Oh, it's time to feed my pet crocodile. What could possibly go wrong? Hello, everybody. I'm Kindly Kid, and welcome to Happy Animals. This is my happy crocodile that needs to be fed. So I'm going to do that. Tap and hold to feed. Seems good. Okay, I understand. I hope you enjoyed that steak. Dude, look at my arm, like, shaking. I Honestly, if I had to stick my entire arm into a crocodile's mouth to feed him. Ah, no! Oh, my God. Gosh! Um, oops. Uh, <laughs> oops. Okay, um, learn my lesson. Probably let go! Gosh! I don't like this. Okay, just set it down! No! <laughs> he got me again. He, he laughed! He knows what he's doing. <laughs> I'm like, please, please don't. Okay, take it! Gosh! That was so close. Okay, crocodile fed. Feeling good. Wash the baby elephant. This seems way less dangerous. Hose him down. Hose down the baby elephant. Look at how cute he is. Look at how happy he is. No risk of getting eaten. I, I, there is, I guess, a, a slight risk of getting trampled because elephants are quite large. But that's a happy elephant. And I am a happy zookeeper because I didn't get eaten. What is going on here? Sort the... Oh my gosh. I, I, didn't, I didn't know what I was doing. I'm sorry. Oh, all those. Those llamas are dead. No! <laughs> the lion! <laughs> okay, you gotta you gotta put the lions with the lions! Why though? Like seriously. I didn't know. I thought that I had to swipe my finger. Apparently, I just have to tap the fence. Lions with lions. Good job. I'm very good at this zoo thing. Llamas with the llamas. Great. Enjoy llama time. Are we going to get another llama? Yes, we are. So we just keep it the way that it is. Look at me being a zoo guy and then probably a lion. I imagine. There you go. There you go. Everybody's happy. Why do we put the lion pen right next to the llama pen? Seems dangerous for the lions. Did you see what those llamas did to that lion? Steal the lion's meat. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um. So I figured this is kind of like the crocodile situation where we need to hold. No! Why would you why would you do that when okay, you're you're supposed to avoid doing that while the lion's looking. Okay, so wait until he looks away. Go, go, monkey, go! No! Get out of there! Okay. <laughs> this is awesome. I love it. We gotta do it one more time. Get get out of there! Get out of there. You did it, little monkey. What is that monkey gonna do? Like, monkeys don't eat raw meat, right? Maybe they do. Maybe he'll cook it up. Have a nice stick. Control the head to catch the food. Okay, this seems great. Livy, Livy, I hippo eating my uh my watermelons. Hey, you, did you guys know this? Fun fact: uh, hippos are actually the most dangerous animals in Africa. Like, they account for more human deaths than all the other dangerous animals that are there, like lions and cheetahs and all those like deadly predators. No, nope, it's the hippos. Extremely dangerous. But this hippo, very cute. I love his dance too, and I love that there's a little bird hanging out on his back. Alpaca haircut. Oh, I thought they were llamas. I guess alpacas and llamas are pretty similar, right? Let's, uh, <laughs> I guess it's time to, to buzz him. All right, look at how happy he is. Oh my gosh. I got to get around to the other side and I don't really know how. So I'm just going to do my best. I'm doing a really poor job, on, especially around the neck. We got to clean up that neckline. There you go. Oh, that's a that's a great looking alpaca right there. Run to bananas. Tap to start. Okay. Oh, th this is like a runner style game. Okay, I understand. I've played plenty of these. So I just need to get the monkey stacked up high enough that I can get over the, the barriers, right? <laughs> this is so cute. Oh my goodness. This is a great game. Like it's a compilation of a whole bunch of mini games. They're they're very cute, and I love the animal aesthetics. <laughs> and all the monkeys eating their bananas. Notably, no monkeys eating raw meat. Just saying. Clean the walkways. Okay, so I'm I'm just guiding this thing. Oh yeah, well that's super easy. I can handle that. I bet you these get a lot more complicated though. Yeah, cause. 
So the way it works, it's kind of like ice levels in like Zelda games. When you push a block, it keeps going the direction that you push it until it runs into something. So I bet you these mini games are going to get pretty complicated. But for now, that was pretty easy. Um, prepare the animal feed. Oh, it's a uh, it's it's fruit ninja. I, I played plenty of fruit ninja in my day. Do I need to cut up the fruit more? Maybe cut them up into little littler bits, not one slice, but like lots of little slices. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably the play right there. Look at that combo. Oh my gosh. Fruit ninja meat all day. You think like real zookeepers are, are out there like throwing fruit in the air and then just swinging a knife around? Probably not. This bonus level though looks insanely fun. Let's do it. All right. How does this work? You just tap the fly. What you need to wait until the fly stops, I guess. Or you just miss. Okay, there we go. It's another fly. Thank you very much. Oh, this gecko is growing. <laughs> it's gross how he smashes into the screen. Got him. That's another one. Thank you very much. Yo, this, this iguana is getting kind of scary. This is like Tasty Planet style. Eventually that iguana is going to eat the entire earth. <laughs> oh no. Oh, I'm so going to get eaten. Okay. Do we just, oh, I see. We're drawing a path and then he follows the path. I kind of want to try that level again, but walk the zookeeper directly into the crocodile. I want to see what it looks like to fail this level. But for now, I'm going to try to avoid this wheelbarrow. Although, you know what? Let's crash into the wheelbarrow. <laughs> it's so stupid. Oh, man, I love it. All right, wheelbarrow guy. I'm, I'm good. Look at how good I am at delivering meat to my pet lions. Sort the animal feed. Okay. Um... So I guess I just I just pull these things out. So th this is just showing me like how the mechanics of the game work. I bet it gets a little bit more complicated. Oh yeah, that makes sense. I didn't see the hole in the side, okay? So probably what I wanna do is remove the bottom one first. Should I remove the middle one as well? And then just drop those apples straight in? Yeah. Okay. Help to get food. Um, okay. Oh, oh, I'm actually controlling the alpaca. Uh, go. You got your food. You got your apples. He's very happy. Ah, I see. So, so monkey goes to bananas. Banana. And then alpaca goes to apples. Although I imagine that they'll eat. Those fruits are interchangeable with those animals. I mean, I'm pretty sure an alpaca will eat bananas and a monkey will eat apples. Who's the real zoo master now? <laughs> Definitely not me. No, not again. Oh, 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 there's three of them. I have to feed three crocodiles this time, huh? Okay, fair enough. It's gonna jump. Oh, gosh. I need to hold it longer. <sighs> Breathe, Kian. Breathe. You got this. <laughs> you got this. Ah! Okay. All right. Who else wants sub? This guy's going to take all the meat. Die! Okay. Okay. All right. I kind of want to fail. Should I just hold it? I'm going to hold it. I'm going to do it. I'm so sorry, zookeeper guy. Release to feed safely. It won't let me. It wouldn't let me fail. That, that kind of bums me out, but I definitely feel better watching these crocodiles dance. I'm okay. Plus, on the bright side, I didn't get eaten by a crocodile. So that's pretty cool. What's happening here? Help to quench for Help to quench thirst. Okay. Uh, I got to move the bucket and then fill that guy up with water. And then I think that I probably just put it in front of the elephant. There you go, bud. Enjoy that. It's a happy elephant. And I'm a happy zookeeper. Whoa. Whoa. I'm unlocking stuff now. Bonus love. My cashier. Let's do it. Okay. Tickets. I guess I just print as many tickets as there are people standing. So I do three, two. Am I doing it right? <laughs> it seems like I'm doing it right. One, two, three, four, five. Five, six, seven, four, six. What comes after six? Oh, good. All right. Because that's as far as I can get. I guess we got fortunate there. Uh, four. I can do that. Look at how good I am at this. I, I could do this all day. I'm making money. Everybody's happy. What are we unlocking, though? That's what I want to know. Maybe a new animal? Oh, no, not this again. Okay, I guess monkeys go with the llamas? Sure. All right. Okay, I'm putting a lion in the in the llama pen. Just, <laughs> they're gonna... <getting, laughs> poor lion. I never thought I'd see the day that a band of llamas, or alpacas, sorry, would beat up a lion. Today's that day. Uh, go in your pen. Now, what happens if I put a monkey in the lion pen? I can't believe I'm going to do this. Yeah, that's going to be a bad day for that monkey. Mm. He got out. <laughs> 
It's so good. Man, this game has some really, really nice touches that I, I think are, are great. All right, switch sides. Monkeys go to the alpaca pen. Look at them dancing. Those are some happy monkeys. And then lion goes to the lion pen and everybody's happy. I still think that we should have the pens a little bit further apart, but... You know what? It is what it is. Two more levels and we'll unlock whatever's in that box. All right, we're feeding the hippo. Not that. Don't eat anvils. Why is my zookeeper throwing anvils at me? That's messed up, man. I love this. This is like the digital version of Hungry Hungry Hippos. And this hippo is hungry. It's very satisfying the way that he chomps down on those watermelons. Oh no, this alpaca. Oh, you poor thing. Um, I guess, yeah, okay. So take out all the stick yeah, get rid of all that gunk. That's uncomfortable. Do I have to shave you now? I'm good. I'm good. Yo, what's in the box? I don't know what these are, but you know what? Give me an ad and let's find out. What are these things? Poker chips? What? What did that do? I still don't know what that did. Uh, tap to have fun. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's a giant monkey. All right, cool. So I guess those those chips um, give you like a, a bonus for, for a particular level that you're on. Seems awesome. All right, we're cleaning the walkways. Um, like I said, I think this is going to get much more complicated. Uh, yeah, we got to go up and then to the left. Yeah, okay. And then you go down to the right, up, and then back to the left. You're good to go. Next round. Uh, this doesn't seem too bad. Yeah, just go left. Not too hard. Oh my goodness. I have to save that monkey on a tightrope while being attacked by crocodiles. Sounds like a, a pretty intense day for a zookeeper. Let's do it. All right. Here we go. Oh my gosh. I don't know what to do. Like, oh, I have to balance him. Okay. Okay. I understand. So, so when he starts leaning, I go back to the right. Go back to the right, dude. All right. All right. Left, left. Okay. This is terrifying. What? Look at this monkey's face too. He knows what he's doing. Get out of here, you stinking monkey. I should just let you get chomped by these crocodiles. You know what you're doing. Oh my God. <laughs> it's terrifying. <laughs> oh, just another day as a zookeeper, I guess. Tight roping while dodging crocodiles. I didn't realize that zookeepers and Indiana Jones have so much in common. But let's do some more fruit ninja. But now it's also meat ninja because we're chopping up some meats. Oh, man. Oh, that's going to be good stuff. Crocodiles are going to love this. Although crocodiles probably prefer that their, their meats are just entirely whole. You know what? They get what I throw at them or what I directly put into their jaws and risk getting my arm eaten. In fact, getting my entire person eaten. I am hungry. What is going on here? Oh, I see. Okay, so this is the, the draw. I have to draw the path. But I have a bit of an obstacle in the form of an elephant that is spraying water. So hopefully we start moving. Okay, we made it. No problem. Easy enough. I kind of want to use the little chip thing. Should we try the chip thing on this level? You know what? Let's do it. What happens? What happens when I use the chip? Nothing? <laughs> I don't I don't know, actually. No, oh, he's so fast. <laughs> I crashed into the fence. I'm such a fool. All right, go. <laughs> He's so fast. That's amazing. Love it. More, more chips. More chips. You know what? Let's get them. Let's try out the chip on this level. I don't think I necessarily need it. Uh, why would you do that to me, game? Is that supposed to help me or hurt me? Because it's making me want to throw up. I understand what I need to do, though. Um, yeah, there. That should get him the apples that he needs. Huh. All right, I'm just going to go barf real quick. Let's use a chip on this level. See what happens. We got him to use what? the kids swapped with the, the adults. What? Okay. I guess I'll take the the child lion to the uh, to the meat and then the alpaca to the apples very cute if nothing else is very very cute I understand get you over here and then we get you over there easy enough this is great I love all these little mini games oh boy <laughs> Feeding more crocodiles. And I, I can't even use my chips. So you just got to do this the old fashioned way, I suppose. I, I've learned my lesson, though. Now I'm using a machine to feed the crocodiles. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Very smart. Don't use your arm. All right. Throw it on the hook and just press the button. Make the make the robot do all the work for you. Oh, why didn't I start the robots? They don't mind losing arms. 
I certainly do. I, I appreciate having all of my arms. They're very good to me. Wash the baby elephant. Oh my gosh, you're filthy. Let's see what happens when I use the, the chip. It's just like a mega. Oh my gosh, it's rainbow shower time. <laughs> There's bananas falling from the sky. What is happening? This is incredible. I'm washing this elephant with rainbows and I don't even know why it's better than water but it looks great. Not to mention the banana rain that we're now experiencing because of this situation. Stop hiding. Come back, baby elephant. You're almost there. There you go. Looking, looking spick and span. And now you can enjoy all those bananas that just magically fell from the sky. Sort the animals. I'm always very good at this. Let's use a chip. Uh, okay. Are these people like helping me? Cause I feel like it's moving at a much faster pace than normal. I kind of want to see what happens here. He went into the wrong pen. So they're not necessarily helping me. They're just moving faster than the animals normally do. I don't know. I don't know what that did for me, but either way, uh, we win. I'm the greatest zookeeper ever. Dude's just holding the alpaca. You can put the alpaca down now. Well, like I've always said, happy animals means happy me. Actually, I've never said that before, but fair enough. 